Hi, my name is Thomas, and I'm a systems librarian at a university library. Basically, I'm responsible for all the computers in the library, but I still work with the students. This is a panicking freshman. She's waited until the last minute to do any work and has a paper due tomorrow. <laughs> Normally, when confronted with a freaked out student, I make something up, usually involving radioactive chickens. Fake my own death, but that can get messy. With the Nokia N810, I don't have to resort to cheap theatrics. We can look up articles in online databases, and we can use the online catalog to find books while we're out in the shelves, so I'm not tied down to a desk. Another part of working in a university is meetings. Lots of meetings. Since I work with technology, most of my meetings are with the other tech groups outside of the library. They have, let's say, more resources at their disposal when it comes to hardware. With the N810, I'll no longer suffer from hardware envy. I can take important notes, or do what everyone else is doing and watch hilarious videos on YouTube. And if they update the Skype client for video, I can just Skype into the meetings from the NA10 wherever there's a Wi-Fi signal. This is my wife, Amy. Hello. Amy is an excellent cook, so she spends a lot of time in the kitchen. And that means I spend a lot of time there, too. Of course we can use the NA10 to look up recipes online or just browse the web while we wait for something to cook. We'd love to listen to music while cooking, and we could use great programs like Canola to stream internet radio stations or music from our audio library. But I'd really love to use the NA10's browser to control the web interface for our hacked Xbox, running Xbox Media Center. With the N810 and Xbox Media Center, I can control the music from anywhere in the house and not miss a beat. Because of where we live, Amy and I both have to drive a lot. Unfortunately, Amy tends to get lost quite a bit. This is what she looks like after one wrong turn. Two wrong turns and three wrong turns. With the NA10's built-in GPS, Amy won't ever get lost again. So maybe if I'm not using it, I'll let her have it for the day. Gee, thanks. Of course, I never get lost. Yeah, right. But I do spend a lot of time in the car. The only thing that keeps me sane through all that traffic is listening to podcasts. When I'm rushing out the door, the last thing I have time for is syncing my music player with a cumbersome cable. With a simple add-on like G Potter, I can download all of my podcasts to the N810 and go, avoiding tragic scenes like this. Of course, there's so many uses for the N810 that I can't possibly cover them all. So here's a list of things I'll use the N810 for. And here's a list of things I won't use it for. Thanks for watching.